Baby, when I tell you 2023 was hard for me, it was hard. Like 2023 felt like a struggle year. I'm gonna try not to cry. I don't think I'm gonna cry. I think I'm gonna be good. Have a seat, have a seat, settle down. <laughs> y'all play too much. Hey y'all, welcome back to another video. Happy New Year. Oh my goodness, this is my first video for the new year, y'all. And I know y'all like, girl, why is you so excited? Where you been, where you been? I know, I know, calm down, calm down, calm down, settle down. I know y'all tired of my BS. I did two months off, and then I came back for like a couple videos, probably one or two, if I'm not mistaken. And then I disappeared again for two months, girl. I mean, I know y'all can tell obviously that something is going on first things first is let's talk about 2023 baby when i tell you 2023 was hard for me it was hard and i feel like a lot of people have been saying this i've been on tiktok and instagram and i've been seeing a lot of people say 2023 was just not the year and it was not the year for me either 2023 felt like a struggle year i felt like i could not get ahead <laughs> It's like every time I felt like I was doing a little bit more, it's like I got set back again. I don't really talk about my setbacks a lot or like when I'm really struggling mentally, financially, whatever the case may be. I don't really talk about it too much. I just kind of sit in it. So 2023 was a very silent year of struggling for me. I mean, I've talked to my family and close ones, loved ones, but I don't really talk about it a lot. I just kind of like try to figure it out, keep going. You know, try to be positive, Polly. Keep going. But when you really going through shit in real life, it's really hard to come on camera like making videos. I'm just being honest. I felt like I just kept falling down. And every time I got up, I fell again. And I got up and I fell again. And I just felt like I just couldn't get ahead. And I don't know what it was. And I was very moody this year. Like my mood, my energy, it just was not high like it usually is. I just didn't really feel myself this year. I don't know what it was from, what happened. <laughs> It's not funny, but you have to laugh to make light of the situation, right? I felt like I was in a funk for almost a whole year, and I'm still feeling like it a little bit. I, I, didn't, I didn't feel like just because the new year started that, oh, I'm back, I'm better, I feel good. No, I still feel like something is off with me, and I don't know what it is. I cannot put my finger on it, but something is still off, but I will shake back. Some things that I did do close to the end of the year, which was in December, is I went to go see my family and I went to go see my friends. My brother graduated from college with his master's degree, so we are so excited for him. So, you know, we all wanted to get together, you know, celebrate him and also just spend time with the family because it, it has been a while since we've all been together. So that was so, 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 nice and intimate and i just love it y'all i'm just such a family girl i just love my intimate times with my family my friends my close ones my loved ones people that is dear to my heart so then literally like a less than a week i went to go visit my friends because my brother like i said graduated so i had a good time with my friends like it was good seeing my friends it was good seeing my aunt shout out to my aunt too because i know she be watching my channel shout out to my aunt okay being back in virginia was not <laughs> Like the vibes, it just wasn't it, y'all. It's so dry and dead there. And it's not that like shit on Virginia or nothing like that. Cause I lived there, right? I lived there for a very long time. It just made me realize that I know why I moved and I see why I move. I understand why I move. I know why I needed to move because I would not have been happy there. I had a great time seeing my friends and my family. That is the good part, you know? As far as content goes, my plan, y'all, I'm not sure if i want to do it just like this y'all i know i'm all over the place with this channel but i'm kind of over this channel i love y'all but i'm over the growth of the channel so i think i want to make this channel just for y'all and for vlogs like that's it i thought i wanted to do fitness on i i don't i thought i wanted to do content for fitness and health and all that only and no vlogs i lied 
I don't think that this channel is for that. I think that y'all really do enjoy the vlogs and I'm gonna continue giving y'all the vlogs. So that is what's gonna be for this channel only is vlogs. That's it, strictly vlogs. And then I'm gonna make a new channel. I wanna start fresh this year with a new channel with my fitness and health and everything, solely that. So I wanna just separate the two so there is no confusion with the algorithm. And plus I just wanna grow a new channel and just see you know, now that I've seen what I'm able to do and learn over these years that I've had my channel, maybe I can start incorporating new things and new strategies, new ways of growing a brand new channel. What have I been up to outside of seeing my family, going through it, whatever the case may be. Y'all, I have been working. Let me come close. I have been working a lot. I appreciate it and I'm grateful because, and, and let me tell y'all quick looks. This is this is the update. I gotta talk y'all to death in this video, right? I know, cause y'all wanna know what's going on, right? The time where I was really, last year, kinda like almost the end of the year, where I was really going through it financially, I almost had to get a second job because I had put myself in a situation in a hole that I could not get out of. It was like, no matter how much I worked, it did not change. So I'm like, yo, I might have to get a second job because this ain't working. <laughs> But it's like right when I almost got a second job, God said, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I don't need you working another job, right? It's okay, I got you. So what happened was the company that I work for, there's another department that we work closely with that always offers overtime, y'all. They've been offering overtime the entire 2023. The only reason why I was not doing it in the beginning of the year is because I was not trained for that department. And I didn't think the training was as simple as it was, but something at the end of the year told me to ask my manager, can I learn the training for that department? And baby, when I tell you that was a blessing, <laughs> That was a blessing. So I got approved to do overtime for them. And y'all, I have been doing overtime since the beginning of November, I believe it was. So I haven't really been in the mindset or just, I just haven't been thinking about a video. I'm just being honest. I've been wanting to do it, but it's like battling the funk, working too much, no balance, right? But the goal is to get some kind of balance because I still wanna work, I ain't gonna lie, I still gotta get to the money. I have to also do what I love to do, which is, you know, content. So that's just a little update on what's been going on with me. I've been working a lot, y'all. Health and fitness, ooh, child. Hold on, let me sip some tea for that one, hold on, girl. Y'all know how much I love the gym, working out, healthy, healthy shy, healthy rhyme. You know, I love all that, right? That's a part of me. That's who I am at core. However, I was also not in the gym for almost two months. So it wasn't just y'all that was getting slack. It was the gym. My eating habits hasn't been terrible because I'm kind of like around the same weight, probably like a couple pounds over than what I was. The gym has not been gymming. The body is still giving a little something, but I haven't been into the gym. I haven't been getting up at five something in the morning like I used to. I'm just like, I'm just off. I'm disappointed in myself for 2023, but it's okay, right? It's a new year, it's a new start. Now, the end of 2023, y'all. I don't know if y'all know, but I have I think I've included little small clips of me talking to my grandma in my vlogs and stuff, if I'm not mistaken. I'm gonna try not to cry. I don't think I'm gonna cry. I think I'm gonna be good. I am very close to her. I've built a stronger relationship with her over the past couple years, right? To where I talk to her, I'm not gonna say every single day, but most likely on a weekly basis. I'll try my best, right? She passed away the very end of December, right? So, Already having a crazy year, which is how I was feeling. It was like at the end of the year, that happening for me was like crazy. I'm not gonna say it was completely unexpected. I'm not gonna get too much into it for personal. I'm not doing that. But what I will say is that it wasn't completely unexpected. It was time to try to process it before it happened. But you will never be...
I, I just don't. And that could be me trying not to believe it so that it makes me feel better. But it is something that me and my family is still dealing with. It's, it's very, 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 very new. So, I wanted to end the video off there. I didn't want to, you know, start off with that because it probably would have made me sad and I probably wouldn't have finished this video, just being honest. So anyway, that's that. Um, I'm excited again, like I said, for the new year. I appreciate y'all for even still supporting me. And I put a little post on my community tab. Y'all was commenting. Y'all so sweet. Y'all are so sweet. I love y'all so much. So the next video will most likely be sometime soon we're gonna say soon the goal is every sunday but we're not gonna commit just yet we have to get back into routine first and then maybe having some time of being consistent before we just say that's what it's gonna be anyway comment some love some hearts some positive words energy goals one goal you don't have to share all your goals that's your personal business but yes i'm excited uh, that's pretty much it y'all so if you like the video give me a thumbs up if you do not like the video give me a thumbs up i appreciate y'all for clicking on our video and i will see you guys in my next vlog <laughs> Peace.